All right, let's let's get started, eh, Kroki? Yeah, you know, I think I, I think we should train our little friend Bellsprout here. I mean, he, it's almost adorable, but at the same time, so strangely, um, not. In fact, I'd go so far as to call it undorable. And yeah, Bellsprout, you're undorable deal with it, okay? I'm, uh, I didn't mean to hurt your feel-goods. I didn't mean to call your parents into question. But they were probably ugly, too. So, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I had to discuss this with you. And, frankly, I wish I'd never brought it up. Um, now, we're going to go and, uh, I think let's let's go ahead and make all other bell sprout pay too by paying homage to the uh, sprout tower but in reality we just like to beat up old men nobody needs to tell anyone that um, because it's none of their business you see I operate on the uh, basic idea that my my interest in defeating old men in combat is perfectly normal and no one should be allowed to discourage my creativity. Yes. This is a creative outlet, and artists are never understood, and all that other nonsense about smoking before you give birth. You see, I talk funny when I don't have Batsley around. I just... I don't know what's going on. Forgive me. Forgive me, Pidgey and Kroiki. And, well, not you, Bellsprout. I could really care less what you have to say. But, and you too, Sentra, and your, all your adorable cuddliness. But I, I don't mean to say these things. I've gone completely mad in Batsley's absence. Please, Batsley, come home. I miss you. Pidgey misses you, and... She doesn't even know who you are. That's how important you are to me, Batsley. You make me make other people make up their emotions just to make me feel better. You see, Batsley? It's cold without you. But someday, don't worry. Someday I'll find you. This, I swear beyond a shadow of a doubt. Hey, hey, your name's Sage Chow. Your name's stupid. You should be ashamed of yourself. Sway like the leaves in the wind. You know, your so, um, obsession with Bellsprout is unhealthy. In fact, you're all a little unhealthy. I mean, it's a Bellsprout, dude. Seriously, that's all it is. You need to get over it. Look, another bell sprout. Go, Kroike! Excellent work, Kroike! Yeah! Oh. How dare you hit Pidgey! Oh. You know, Pidgey, I need a good nickname for you. It's got to be something adorable, yet awesome. Hmm. What should I name you, Pidgey? What should I name you? Don't worry, Pidgey. I'll come up with something. You too, Sentret. And Bellsprout, you can be named Dongle for all I care. That's right. You know, I might just name you that to spite you. I know it wouldn't be very nice. Especially since, you know, Bellsprout's never done anything to me other than be ugly near me. Hurts my image. It really does. I don't even know... You know, why am I even bothering giving you experience, Bellsprout? Or should I say, Dongle? Or Donny G, as it were?
Um, yeah. So, Kuroki, you lead instead. That way you get... That way you get experience. Instead of that stupid bell sprout. Besides, I don't want to turn into one of these old men that just carries around dongles with them to make them relive past memories of dongledom. I want to be more mature than that. Your head is bright. You're bald, stupid. God. It's like these people don't even look at themselves in the mirror. Oh, wait, did he say my head was bright? I have hair, you you pompous monk. Old man. I have a tip for you, old man. Call the uh, exterminator. Because Kroiki's in town. And Kroiki, Kroiki lives to slap old people around. Okay, I'm sorry, Kroiki. I don't mean to hurt your image or anything, but, but I like to scare old people. I know you don't like to hit old people, because that's not, that's not nice. So, I would like to remind all of my viewers, don't hit an old person. Hug them. Did you hug your grandpa today? Yes, yeah, Sprout Tower is a wonderful place where you worship things shaped like... Well, I'm not sure what they're shaped like. I'm sure I could make allusions to a number of different things, but I will not, because I'm more mature than that. See, old man? I don't have to build a tower dedicated to dongles to make myself feel better. You, too, could be this mature. In fact, you could be as mature as some people are and not even mention it. But, you know, where's the fun in that? Though you do raise hoot hoots, too, which just lends to the um, immaturity. You, you raise hooters and bell sprouts. Yeah. You guys, you guys are awesome. I want to be in your club when I'm old. Yeah, thank you for Flash. That's cool. It even illuminates dark places. That's cooler. Oh, what? I forgot you could run into Pokemon in here. Get out of my way, ghastly. <laughs> and we're free of Sprout Tower. I think I think in the next episode we'll take on uh we'll take on Faulkner. Yeah. Take on that gym trainer. Gym leader. Son of a gun. I can't think. <laughs>